quick pace to start this one as both exchange punches, kicks and knees. Bukai swarming the Han at this point, and this may be quickly over as knees being thrown to the body of Mahan. Fukai is all over him here in the early going. Yeah, he is, and the, the official unfortunately did not see there were a, a few head strikes when uh, Mahon went down and uh, those got unchecked and uh, hopefully it doesn't uh, end up going against Mahon here but uh, credit his toughness because he took a heck of a lot of shots and he's coming back and good technique here nice kicks actually. So Mahan ate it early from Elvis Bukai, who said he was going to come forward to start this fight. And that was absolutely the case. But Mahan comes on with his own. He's trying to pass, trying to get into side control. Bukai keeping him at bay thus far. Throws him aside and moves in. Again, a nice defense on the ground from Bukai, and Mahan lets him up. Huh? Superman punch coming from Elvis as he tries to uh, to land one, but that one didn't get through. Well, the one thing you could say about Fukai, he's got a lot of power, and again, Mahon said it right. He said that those those punches aren't coming very accurately, but they're very fast, and if you move the wrong way, uh, it can cause you a lot of problems, and these are huge shots being thrown right now by these two guys. Both fighters landing big shots. Elvis Fukai threw so much into the left hand that he fell down delivering it. And some Muay Thai clinching going on here. Uh, checking those knees and trying for a takedown. Got a single leg, he's in good position here. He needs to take him back off the cage uh, just with some chest pressure. Fukai is giving it to him right now uh, by taking his back off of the cage and uh, abandoning the leg attack and wanting to go up top uh, is Mehon. Again, making his amateur debut, Vukai with the draw. So both these guys looking for their first win in, uh, in the cage. Both fighters exchanging knees up against the cage. 40 seconds left, according to our feature productions fight club. And some blood coming from the nose of Vukai. Both fighters landing big strikes, huge right hand thrown there by Mahan. Big connect there, and that was a very accurate shot, followed by another one. You don't have to land 50 if you land one really accurate. And blood now coming from the mouth of Elvis Fukai as well. Randy Mahan's strikes have done their damage here in round number one. Both fighters setting a furious pace for our fifth fight of the night. Depends on what the judges are looking for and what they want. So more blood coming from the mouth and nose of Elvis Fukai. Didn't get a chance to stop it in the corner, or it wasn't, uh, they didn't effectively stop it in the corner between rounds as it's uh, it's dropping pretty hard out of the face of Fukai. But Mahan comes out striking both these fighters. A little more tentative to start round number two. Well, both of them took huge shots and a nice catch there. And if you look, this is some very quality fighting from Randy Mahon, and it is, his his striking is accurate, it, it's compact, it, he's not looping his punches, they're coming straight forward, the technique is there. Um, you know, the the athleticism of Vukai is is being able to battle this, this consistent and technical striking from uh, Mahon. Yeah, Vukai trying to move forward, but Mahan doing a good job of covering up in the early going of round number two. Big kicks thrown by both fighters, and Mahan felt that one. Vukai tried to come in with a kick and punch combo that almost caught Mahan right on the chin. Yeah, and <laughs> these guys are both throwing crazy shots. Uh, Wow, nice two-punch combination, but uh, blood streaming from the nose and mouth of Elvis Vukai. Mahan continuing to come forward. Those leg kicks have got to be affecting Mahan because you can see every time he takes one, he goes back and takes an extra step to maybe walk it off just a touch as Elvis Vukai is throwing dangerous leg kicks and continues to do so and now is following them with punches. Well, definitely the aggression is uh, aggression score is definitely going to Elvis Vukai. He's the one stepping forward, but I cannot get over how technical for an amateur debut that Randy Mahan's 
punches are. They are just amazing, amazingly technical punches that are landing very accurately, and you can see the damage on Vukai's face. Kick there thrown by Mahan. Not much on it though, just the toes, but you can start to see around the, the knee of Elvis Vukai, because he's wearing the shorter shorts, you can see the damage on both legs. Big welt on the inside of the knee of Vukai. Yeah, and that's where you want to land the kick. Again, it's it's about accuracy. Kicks in the thigh are one thing, and yes, they they will slow a fighter down, but that spot right above the knee uh, is is where you want to be hitting. And good cage control here by Arani Mehan. But Elvis Fukai like a high knees exercise in football, just throwing them into the midsection. Both of these fighters, again, another round that may be too close to call in this last 10 seconds could decide it. And trying for a throw and nothing doing there at the end. Well, no <laughs> option there for Elvis Fukai, though, as there was no one else in the cage. Yeah. Big right hand from Mahan and a low blow from Elvis Fukai. He disagrees and says it wasn't a low blow, but it looks like it looks like that one, not even a touch of the gloves, but a hug at the center of the cage. So uh, all is well and good as we resume round number three with two minutes and 40 seconds left in this, our fourth fight of the night. And for those of you who aren't MM necessarily MMA fans, and no, these guys are fighting, they don't hate each other. There's there's not a hate, they're, they're here, they're competing in a martial art. Uh, yes, it, it's bloody, yes, it's violent. But these guys have ultimate respect, and when there's an accident like that, you see, and, and this is not an uncommon occurrence to see two fighters come together like that and just show how much they do respect one another for getting in the cage. Great shot there, a right hand by Vukai. Yeah, a nice right hand that slipped inside as Mahan tried to come forward up against the cage. Now Mahan has Vukai, and again, having him up against the cage like this can do nothing but good in the judges' scorecard. Well, it also takes away that athleticism because you look at Vukai and you've seen some of those athletic things that he's done, the Superman jumps, the punches from way outside that still landed. And uh, if you're pushing a guy up against the cage, he can't use that athleticism against you. Then it comes to technique. Uh, you look at Vukai, had a nice little good head and arm position, but uh, wasn't able to get his hips through to be able to throw it. So again, both fighters continuing to throw strikes here. <laughs> and... Uh, and earlier tonight when I talked to Elvis, he said it was going to be a stand-up show and because uh, that's what he's all about. Uh, English, not his strongest suit, but was very clear that he wanted to stand and bang, and he certainly done that here tonight and found a willing participant in Randy Gamer. Yeah, will, willing participant, I think, is an understatement. Uh, he's found a guy who uh, has very technical striking, uh, has no interest in keeping this fight on the ground. And uh, both these guys have done a fantastic, I don't want to be a judge in this fight. No, certainly not. I, I can't, uh, you know, I, I've done a lot of these fights now. Uh, I've, I've done a lot of MMA events, and I, I could not tell you who's going to win this fight at this point. And normally with 40 seconds left in round number three, I've got a pretty good idea. Yeah, I, I think either of these rounds could go either way, and that's why we have three judges at three different vantage points. Uh, technical striking, definitely to, to Mahon. There's, there's no question there. Uh, explosive striking, uh, definitely to Vukai. Uh, aggression to Vukai, and both these guys trading leg kicks now. Less than 10 seconds left, and here's where we're gonna see these guys go. And maybe a takedown attempt here, pushing up against Cage. Big shots there by both guys as they try and close out this fight. Both fighters throwing amazing strikes here at the end of round number three. That was a war and I, 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 so far an early candidate for our fight of the night bonus.